Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Alyssa, and I told you that this week that there would be a series of three videos. The first video, which I posted yesterday, was about the look that I created today, as well as today's video, number two, is going to be me swatching the Crystal Zodiac palette. So if that is what you're interested in, then keep on watching. Okay, let's start swatching. So this first shade right here, Rhodonite, I really like because it kind of really looks like it's gemstone. So I really like that. So again, Rhodonite. So let's swatch. It's mixing the colors together. So it looked like a rosy gold with the blue in it, but on my finger, it looks like a metallic blue. So let's go ahead, Rhodonite. So it comes out very sheer. So let's just do a little bit more. Go over it. Ta-da. So it looks like a, a shimmery gray with some blue in there. I like it. It's very sheer. I like it. It could do like a good smoky effect. The next one, Rose Quartz, which I did use on my eye. So let's go into that one. Put it right next to Rhodonite. Comes off very sheer. You can barely see it, but in person it looks very nice. So let's just do a little bit more for the camera. It's like a very pinkish color. I like it. The next shade, Blue Calcedony. Swatch. Ooh, I like that. These are very sheer but they're very pigmented though as well like you can see the color even though it's like sheer i go over it again you can really see it it looks even better pops oh. <laughs> then we'll go into lapis again it's very sheer but we'll do it again. It's like a royal blue with shimmer. Okay, so I cleaned up my hands. The next shade is amethyst. So, clean finger. Going in. It looks more like a purple. So let's see what that looks like next. This is amethyst. Some more. Go. I'm liking that one. <laughs> Obviously, it's purple. <laughs> uh, but this one, they're all very sheer, but this one seems to be the deepest one. Love that. Then we're going to go into Jade right here. Oh, I love that. Okay, I'll make my eyes pop. So sheer. Also, going to be sheer but very sparkly. I love sparkles. Go. Ooh. We're gonna go into Carnelian. I love how these are all looking like their corpse or... Oh my, I love that. Oh, that is so pretty. That's my favorite color. So Carnelian. Oh my God. Gosh, that's gorgeous. It looks like rose gold. I literally love that. Love that. Okay, then we go into Tiger's Eye. Jeez. This one right here. It's orange and blue. Ooh, 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 ooh. This is like a brown, like a bronzy color, brown. Those two would be so good together. Amber, which I used on my eyes on the outer corners. But amber, love this too. So these two would be so good together. Doing two layers, you can't really see it. Like a white shimmer with like green sparkles kind of but it's really pretty after amber we have 
citrine. So let's get into it right there. Ooh! Oh my gosh. I just like almost broke the palette, but I love that. Oh my gosh, I love this palette. I love it. I love it. Okay. I love how these are sheer though, because they're very, they're like very nice on the eye if you mix them with the matte colors that they have in there. So I do love that. But there we are, smoky quartz. Let's go into that one. Ooh, it's like a green, like a sparkly emerald green. Put that on there. You can, it like looks like emerald green, but then in it, it's like, like green sparkles, like a, like, like a lighter green sparkles. Love that. Hematite, right here. Looks like gray, just looks like gray. Just like how it should. Okay. Ooh. It is like a smoky gray with some sparkles in it, so I love that. That's all of those around. So now we can go into the matted colors. It's, I will do this side of my arm. They have no names for these, so I'm gonna go through these kind of pretty quick. So they have this like white shade that I use on the base of my eye. Really nice base. Then they have a blue. Ooh, uh, love that. Purple. gray or black dark gray oh that's not very pigmented okay actually it looks like a purple like a deep deep purple when i actually swatch it like a darker gray i love how they're by the shades that you can mix them with that's very smart of them and i love that love the layout but this one it's like a green that would go very well with jade and then this like reddish pinkish color going through these very fast because there's no names for these and they're just matted shades but i want to swatch them all for you guys this next one's like a peachy color which i used on my eye next one is yellow oh my gosh that'd be so I can't actually I've never done a yellow eye but I liked the yellow shade so much that citrine and this one I think it'd be so good then we have the white shade And then we have this light gray shade. Some of these are more pigmented than the other, but that you can see them all. So it's good. And we have this dark gray shade, <laughs> dark gray shade. Sorry if I'm going really fast with these. Like again, they are just matted eyeshadows um, with no names, but I wanted you guys to see them all. Then this brown shade, which is the last one of the matted shades. So there you are. The sparkly shades that they base them off of the quartz and minerals. And then the matted eyeshadow shades that go along with those. And then there is the middle one, which is a highlight that I used. So put that on my thumb. I'm gonna put that right here. And like this is a white shade with some blue and green and pink sparkles. All right, so there you have it. I swatched all of the shades for you. If you have any questions about this palette, please let me know. Again, this is Crystal Zodiac by BH Cosmetics. I would love to know by you guys if you do like that I just did a video on swatching or if 
you'd rather me not do that for the future. I want to do this for you, your content for you to help you make your purchases and to let you know my how I feel about them. I overall, again, am very happy with buying this palette. I love how they blend. I love the colors. I love how they look. I love that there are the shimmer shades as well as the matte shades. I don't like how they didn't really name these ones, but I mean, I guess they were kind of going along with the, the look on the outside, so I don't, I don't really know. Um, but overall, I really do like this palette. I really like the brushes that I reviewed in last video, and I will let you know tomorrow how this worked, if it lasts all day, if it had any creasing, if it had, if it bunched up, I will give you the full review on that tomorrow. So I will film a little bit later today to let you know. If you did enjoy my videos, please subscribe, give a thumbs up, again, comment on the bottom if you have any questions. I love to hear from you and I will be seeing you tomorrow. Thanks guys. Bye.